Howdy there, folks, how are y'all doing? My name is Reese, and Buttercup, do you know what today is? It, that, yes, okay, yeah, you're, you're right, it is Thursday, yes, you are correct, but it's also Thanksgiving! It is an American holiday, you are correct. Uh, this is the day in which the pilgrims gave thanks to the Lord for uh, guiding them, protecting them, and helping most of them not starve, or at least a portion of them. I think a lot of them did starve. My history is a little bit rough. I've been out of school for uh, eight years now, so maybe I need to go back and give myself a refresher course. But uh, we, we are today celebrating, of course, with all of our friends in Minecraft. They should be waiting for me inside the hotel. And there is a road. Okay, you know what? I did talk to Mayor Dave between episodes, and I did tell him what I was working on. Maybe he got curious and decided to uh, dispatch his own crew to build a beautiful road all the way up to our pagoda. I don't know if that's what it is. I don't know what the actual definition of a pagoda is. Or even if I'm saying it correctly, is it a pagoda? Why are we walking? We can literally fly. I mean, it is a lovely road. It's a pic Didn't there used to be a mountain here? Someone went through a lot of work excavating this to create this lovely... What happened to our staircase? Oh. It's been deleted. Okay. <laughs> It's been, it's been hashtag cancelled. <laughs> Look at this, though. This is wonderful. Maybe later we'll bring all the guests down and we'll watch the sunset finish behind the volcano. And no one need ever know what happened on the other side of the volcano or the fact that it actually kind of no longer exists. Now, something I did know about because I had a hand in it. I This wasn't me. I guess this was Dave. I built a little something something over here in town. And some of you may see it right now. And uh, I guess we can go take a, a swing by and look at it. We built ourselves a communication tower. Look at that bad boy. So it's back here behind old old Theo O'Quinn. He's our stable boy. Hi, how are you doing? Guess what, guys? We have a stable man. Theodore O'Quinn. Thank you. I guess they're related. Maybe, maybe father, son? I'm not sure. But if we head back behind their house you'll see that we have this brand new communication tower that uh, I can use to contact folks, and uh, I actually used it the other day for the very first time. I say the other day. I built it between yesterday and today. That's that's canon, because these are all being recorded on the day. Today is Thanksgiving. Yesterday was the day before Thanksgiving, and that means that that road was built since, since yesterday. That's crazy, and that was built since yesterday. It's also crazy. But I used it to send my guest list to... Ralphius Aerith, who has hopefully gotten everyone here. Hey, Louis Terry. So Louis Terry, of course, runs the hotel. Hello to you as well. Everyone is so friendly. Everyone is so polite. Let's head up to the third floor. Let's make sure all of our guests are here. And it looks amazing. One moment, please. <coughs> I am choking slightly on, um, I got some materials <coughs> to build window inserts. And you're supposed to use a mask when you, you when you handle them. And I was like, well, I'm not handling them. I just want to crack it open and look at it. So uh, that was a mistake. And I'm probably going to have to go to the hospital and have my lungs checked out just to make sure that, you know, there's no sort of rot or anything taking place. But look at this place. That's a heck of a chandelier. Goodness gracious me. We've got a table for our bountiful harvest. A nice place to sit. Of course, we're all going to come out here and dance some sort of um the trees inside it's a statement you know it's certainly a statement what what is the statement though what is the purpose i don't know <laughs> i could i couldn't tell you what is the what what there's just a crafting table what who did this who did this 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 shouldn't be here Oh, wait, maybe we're supposed to be mixing drinks there. Maybe that's what... No, that doesn't make any sense. You don't mix drinks at a crafting table. Get rid of that. Where where, where, where are guests? Where where are guests? Why is why is empty? Why is there no one here? Is there? Did anyone check into the rooms yet? Anyone check in here? Shh, let's listen up by the wall. Terrace is terrace. Let's listen to the window. Ain't nobody in there. Ain't nobody here. Where's where's the, the whoa? There's there's no one here. Let's go. Let's go ask Ralph. I'm gonna be pretty angry if my guests aren't here. Um, <clears throat> how does this thing work? Uh, okie okay day. Let's go. 
Um, call Ralphius Aerith. Ah, hello, Cam. Hey, Ralph. Hey, listen, uh, sorry to call you at this time, but uh, I had a question regarding the, the guest list that I sent you. Oh, yes? Yeah, n no one's here, and today is, is Thanksgiving. I uh, guess about that. See, I was going to have everyone sent to your location. However, we've put up a very sophisticated net around your world. Would you would you like to enlighten me on, on what you mean by that? Oh, you know, general protection keeps out literally anyone and everything, and also prevents you from leaving and going to join some you know, binds or whatever. I'm sorry, what? I, we're just doing it for your protection. So I'm not going to have any company for Thanksgiving? Well, Buttercup's there. <sighs> it's not the same, Ralph. Well, have you considered spending time with your real family? Oh yeah, I guess I guess I could do that. Uh, excellent then. Um, cheerio. Cheerio. Che Has he ever said cheerio? Well, this is a disappointment. This is a massive disappointment. Can't believe this. Cannot believe this at all. I went. I, I went through all this effort, right? Like, look at this wall that I built. I built this wall so that we could like have this this tower here. And I had to have a retaining wall, otherwise the, the dirt would have eroded away. So I built this entire enclosure here, spent a lot of time doing it. I also, we started to have some foundation problems with the hotel. So I built this little retaining wall as well. It's nothing special, nothing special. And who knows, it might expand over time. We might have to uh, build up this little thing here. I do like, though, that the city has some, some dynamic now. It's not just one flat space, you know? Because everything in here was just one flat space, which works. It's very picturesque, you know, but it's it's a bit bland. But no, now you go outside of the, the secure enclave and you go down, you know, and you want to go up there, you go up and it's got, it's, it's, it's good. It's good. I'm going to go back to my party, you know, it might just be me, but it is my party and I'm going to enjoy my party as best as I can uh, up on the third floor and <clears throat> I guess... Do I have a sit here at this, uh, this couch? Got the sunset out the window there. It's nice, you know, it's good. It's quiet. Hey, why don't we all talk about the things we're thankful for? I, I know some of the things I'm most thankful for in life. I'm thankful for, for my many friends and family who have stood by me for the last, you know, eight years I've been creating content. And I'm thankful for all of my subscribers, all 30,000 of you. Thank you all so much for taking the time to click that subscribe button and for watching my videos. To all the folks who have put up with this series through its ups and, and down, down, downs, and then kind of swings back ups again, you know, for, for watching and listening to me babble on. I appreciate it. And thankful to God for making sure this wasn't my job. Otherwise, I'd be completely shrecked by COPA. So I appreciate that. Christ for dying for my sins. Um, UPS for never losing one of my packages. FedEx for losing three of them, but always talking politely on the phone while we worked out what happened to them. That's useless. Absolutely useless. USPS for... Um, <clears throat> no, no, I'm not thankful to them at all. They're... The, 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 the mail lady came by and like left a note in my mailbox saying that I wasn't here to accept a package, but they never tried to deliver it. And I watched them pull up to the mailbox, put that note in there and then drive away. And I ran out to the mailbox and got the note and then chased them down on the next street over and was like, give me my box. I'm thankful to, to Google, the, the evil Im empirical corporation for, you know, at the very least, Giving me a giving me a start, you know, providing this service. Although I, I think I've uncovered an evil plot concerning them using us as an army to fight the FTC, but aside from that. Thankful to all of my patron supporters, all of my Twitch subs. It's been good, guys. You know, we got a couple more episodes of this series, I reckon. And then the sunset may well be setting. The sun may, may the sun may well set on our time together in Minecraft on YouTube. You know, I just did a couple episodes ago, a whole episode about how things, you know, no one likes change. And I had no intention of changing anything. 
And now here we are where, well, quite honestly, it doesn't look like I have much of a choice, does it? That's life. Sometimes you just gotta play the hand you're, you're dealt. You gotta adapt, expand, and grow. I don't know what else to say. Except thank you folks for watching. God bless you. And I'll see you later. Bye.